up, folks? This is Tom O'Brien of TFNN. We go five days a week. We go seven hours a day. We go 24 hours a day in the internet at TFNN.com. Always remember, folks, whatever you think about, you bring about whatever you focus on grows. Hope everyone's having a great day, safe day. Hope everyone had a great Easter, Passover, all of the above. Always do your best. Practice makes the master. By doing your best over and over, you can master the art of transformation. By doing your best, the habits of misusing your word. Taking things personally and making assumptions will become weaker and less frequent with time. Market wise, let's take a look at it out here. We have the Dow Industrials up 10, Nasdaq's down 2, S&P's up 2.5. Gold contract up nine dollars sixty cents traded at eighteen that nineteen eighty four an ounce. We had silver up forty two cents twenty six dollars twelve cents an ounce. Light sweet crude up a buck one hundred and seven dollars ninety nine cents a barrel. Notes and bonds. The ten year note down seven ticks trading one nineteen twenty two. The thirty year off twenty three at one forty eleven. And king dollar king dollar trading up two hundred eighty one ticks at one hundred point seven eight zero. Euros at one oh seven. Yen's at 126.94, and the British pound is at 130 to 1 U.S. dollar. Our phone number is 877-927-6648. Give us a call, folks. Want to know what's going on in your world. In the world of the S&Ps, let's take a look at them. What do you have? Well, I'm going to bring up the futures first because you got a weak market out here. Market can't hold price. I mean, that's just selling, selling, selling each time that it tries to get into higher price. Bottom line is that we got out here today is that, you know, you had, you had market lower this morning. We had the market down at 43.55. You had a pop. When, as soon as the market up, actually opened this morning, we popped up to this uh, 44.03. Bottom line, gave it up in spades all the way down again. And guess what? We're going right back down the other side right here. And let's just take a look at this for a second. Yeah, what are you going to see? So watch. Your, your pop this morning was at 61,000 contracts, 60, yeah, 61,000. The, the next time we came up there was at 17,000. Forget it, man, 17,000 to 61,000, it ain't even close, folks. Bottom line is that this thing's gonna finish either flat or at the lows out here today, which was the, the 4355, and right now you're at 4389. NQs, let's go take a look at the NQs out here, the live contract inside the NQs, NQs, also, got a little pop at the open out here today. Let me take a look at this. Same setup. Okay, so we started out the day, the 9.30 pop at 27,000, but then the high had 14. So we're gonna take the 14, because that high was tremendously different, meaning the high of the, today, that was the uh, 14,002. And we just got almost up to it. And the bottom line, I couldn't handle it. We got up there with 9,300 versus the 14,000 bottom line. The last 10-minute buy just had 7,000. It's already into the big buy that was established out here at, uh, at 130 this afternoon. That's saying that we're going back downtown uh, and probably going to have a flat market there also. Gold. Gold contract, bottom line, got over that 2,000 and just couldn't handle it. Uh, we got up to a price point of 2003 today. Um, not enough volume, man. The, the bottom line is you only have 130,000 contracts. When you get over like this type of, let me put this up so you can see what I'm talking about. So, you know, it's been over like the top of the consolidation for like three days, but it's been timid. That's the real bottom line. Timid meaning that not, not enough volume on, on the, on the get-go. So we'll see how this baby shakes out, uh, you know. That normally what ends up happening, folks, is has to build more cars to get the higher price. And of course, now we got to go to King Dollar because the, the amazing part is that gold is even at these higher levels when the dollar, okay, is going after the 102 mark. Let me bring this back. You're going to see where this dollar is going. The, the top of this range, okay, is the highs that were established out here in 2015, uh, 17, it's 103.80, 103.820. Now, the thing is going to be wild, man. If you have a bust out of this, <laughs> that dollar could really take off, man. You know, my take is that we're going to get a failure because you have divergence. The divergence being that gold's at highs, just about at highs, 
The doll is at highs. One of them's going to crack. That's the bottom line. If we go take a look at the yen, the yen is not all, also not on the gold side, which makes it even more wild that gold is this high. The yen is trading at 126.95. Now, the deal with the yen is that you have the Japanese central bank saying they're not going to allow the yen to go over 130. So, you know, we've seen this before, meaning the aspect of uh, currency traders going against central banks. And we'll see, uh, we'll see how this shakes out. It's certainly going to go for that 130 mark. You're at 126.94 now. So big number, no doubt about that. We go take a look at the TLT. I know a lot of people looking at notes, bonds, all of the above. Well, the TLT, folks, is in a confirmed ABC structure on the way down. Uh, you, you took out the B point last week. You took it out with volume. There's some monster ABC down. It's a 10.8 A to B. That's going to give you a 114 handle. The B point is 124. It's a 10.8 A to B. This thing has a lot further to go downtown. If we take a look at the 10-year note right now, we are trading at uh, 2.835. So, uh, big number, man. Some of the higher volume equities out here today inside of this market. And this will be a low volume market out here today. We have uh, Twitter's up uh, three bucks. You have Bank of America up a buck forty-three. And Vidya's up five dollars. Uh, let's go to Bank of America, BAC. I believe they came out with their numbers this morning. So Bank of America right now, that's up one forty-two. And okay, so you at the bottom. Let me pull this back on a weekly. That was a monthly, I want a weekly. Okay, so we take a look at weekly. Yeah, we'll see whether it's gonna reject lower price. You know, we got we got to lower price today. We got the 3722. It has rejected it. Um, you know, maybe this thing will stay save itself. Uh when you certainly look at a few of the other banks, uh JP Morgan's a mess. Uh, this this little baby uh, continues to want lower price. It's up two dollars and thirty cents today. But J.P. Morgan already broke a B point of an ABC structure on the way down. Stay right there, folks. Come right back. We have the Dow Industrials right now is trading. Come on, baby. Where are you? Down twenty five. Nasdaq is off twenty one. S and P is off three. You got a market that can't hold price, folks. Stay right there. Come right back.